hey what's up guys and welcome back to another video welcome back to the channel and time to talk at tweaks so for those who already using the new jailbreak on the uncovered jailbreak on ios 13 up to 13.3 and for the most people who using the check rain jailbreak starting from ios 12.4 up to ios 13.3.1 for those who already using the jailbreak here is some top new jailbreak that i want to share with you guys as always guys before i'm gonna be start today's video let me ask you guys to give the video a big thumbs up also make sure to subscribe hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever i release a new cd tweaks video let's go ahead right now to start talking about the first one number one on my list will be the harbor 3 this is will be specific for the ios 13 so that week has been updated right now to work with the new jailbreak so if you don't know what i'm talking about so the harbor is going to be make your device icon here bouncing just like that you can see right now how is the bouncing just like the macbook uh, style the icon will be the same thing this is what the harbor will be make for your jailbroken device and if i go ahead right now and jump under the settings here so first thing we have a couple of sliders one of them is going to be for the high end with wave and also we have some other customizer style for example if you want to use the spring toggle if you want to use the animation app close uh, to toggle that and also we have the number of the bounds here so you can choose i think from one start from one up to uh, a limited app also you can choose the time here and also if you want to toggle the show status dots here hide the deck background if you want to all of that will be came under the settings with that week anyway once again this one will be called the harbor 3 let me go ahead right now to start talking about the next one that i have it's a new one this one is will be called the foldy you can take a look this is one of my folders right now here so once you launch the folder that you have it come uh, with the background you can uh, you can use other customized stuff if you want to change the background you want to make something the title you want to switch the title and some other stuff if you go ahead and navigate inside the settings okay so uh, right now here this is the enable toggle right now here so go ahead first of all enable the tweak and then we have some other stuff if you want to play around with the uh, use corners here the background as i show you if you want to use the alpha here we have the section of the title so if you go through you can read some stuff you can read what is those toggles will be for the background color if you go ahead and tap on it this will be take you to some customized stuff the way that i use right now which is the gradient it here you can use that toggle that uh switch here at the top and then you can use other stuff if you want to here other stuff that comes with that week which is the background uh, frame here if you tap on it this will be bring some other stuff for you if i want to go back clear the mod here if you want to toggle that and also if you want to hide the page dots from in here this is what pretty much that week will be provide you with as i show you guys i mean this one will be bring some nice and cool stuff once you want to launch any one of the folders that you have in your jailbroken device once again guys this one will be called foldy let me jump right now to talking about the other cd tweak which is this one will be a new one for the ios 13 this one will be called the arch so this is the tweak here basically that week will be make you to like any kind of application or app in your jailbroken device simply just go ahead and go to lock apps here this will be provide you and bring all the application that comes in your iphone so if i want to go ahead right now for example toggle the clock here and go to my supreme board if i want to go ahead right now and top on my time here you can take a look once uh once the device recognize my face it will be unlocked application for me so if i want to go back and navigate to inside the settings here you can see this is how is that week will be looks like and this is how is that week will be provide you with 
I mean, this one will be work for the both the face ID and the touch ID as far as you have the both in your jailbroken device. So that week will be work fine with your iPhone. Anyway, once again, this one will be called the Arch. Moving right now to talking about the new one and the next new CD tweak. This one will be called the All Lucency. So if you want to download the tweak, let me show you guys first of all. Enable the tweak and I choose that uh, method right now here. I don't know what is that says, but uh, let me show you guys once you download the tweak. What is that tweak will be for? You can take a look right now. How is everything will be nice and cool so you can see through your CC and then you can take a look what's going on on your Supreme board. The same method will be work if you want to launch one of the folders like that. And then the same thing in the same method will be in here in your uh, widget or your spotlight search and in the same method will be work once you receive any kind of notification in your live screen so the tweak will be transparent most the items that you have in your jailbroken device starting from your control center just like that and other stuff that i already show you so you can take a look that the tweak comes with just a two different kind of method. One of them is going to be here. I think this one will be reduce the light just like that. And the other one, this is the second method here. And I think and I guess this one will be uh, the resupering. But this is the main thing here to enable the tweak. So this is what pretty much the tweak will be came with. As I show you guys, it's really nice and cool stuff to bring into your jailbroken device. As I told you, once again, this one will, will be called the All Lucency. Moving right now to talking about the next one. The next new one will be called the Prism. So if I want to launch my control center right now here, you can take a look how everything will be looks uh, looks really different right now. Most of the modules or the toggles here at the top, you do your volume, it will be used just like that. And then this is your brightness, the other toggles, your player and some other stuff it will be just looks like that if i want to go ahead right now and navigate to inside the settings once i download the tweak it just comes like that for for some reason i don't know why but anyway you can read right now here in each single section this is for your uh, primary settings here and then here the interface here and then the module settings here and some other stuff you can customize all of those from under the settings but once again if i want to go back and launch my control center back again you can take a look how everything will be looks nice and different it wasn't like the uh, regular cc you can take a look if you force that on your brightness or your volume just comes like that the same thought toggles that we have here in control center i told you already about the player here and some other toggle stuff that you have under your CC. So this is how is that week will be looks like and this is the one that I came with. Once again, this one will be called the Prism. Anyway guys, this is the most tweak that I have for you guys in today's video, in today's update. So I hope you guys enjoy today's video. I hope you guys enjoy most of the tweaks that I show you already. So if you guys like the video, make sure to give the video a big thumbs up. Also make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a new CDA Tweaks video. Catch you with the next one. Peace out.